What's good, YouTube? What's good? It's your girl, and I'm back with another oh. video. Oh, he's so weak. He just, I don't know. But yes, guys, before we get to this video, make sure y'all give us a fat thumbs up. Make sure y'all like and subscribe. Make sure y'all share this video with any and everybody. So, guys, today, hold on. So today we're gonna be making homemade chicken pot pie. So let me show you all the ingredients that you will be needing to make this special, special dish. Yeah, this is my first time making it, so bear with me. If you see me mess up, just put it in the comments or email me. Huh? Okay. Leave it down below. Don't butcher me too bad because you know this is your first time. And I'm gonna try to put my feet in like the old folks say. So these are some of the ingredients that you would be needing. Don't mind my baby Wendy's club back there. He had a kid's meal for din uh for dinner or lunch, whatever it wanna be. But these are all the ingredients that you will be needing. If you want everything fresh, you can get it fresh. This is the easy route for me. Okay, y'all. Um, I'm Okay, I done added my onions. I done sauteed it. Now I'm about to add a teaspoonful of garlic. I'm going to stir it in so it won't burn. I've got my onions looking good, y'all. Kishi. Hello, Okay, now I'm about to add in my lovely rotisserie chicken that I've chopped up and pulled the skin off. I'm about to warm that up with the um, onion and garlic. Y'all, it is so good. I'm just going to tell y'all now. With this being my first time making it. I'm gonna incorporate everything. Okay, and now I'm about to add in my seasonings. So I'm adding in my um, accent salt. I don't have a, you know, I don't have a correct amount to put in. Just sprinkle how much you wanna put in. It's to your liking. Now I'm adding my onion powder. My garlic powder. My adobo seasoning. Like I said, to your liking. These are my measurements. So whatever you however you feel like you want to season it, that's that's on you. And I'm gonna add in my complete seasoning. You can add in whatever kind of seasoning you want to add in. Now I'm gonna stir Yay. all of it together. And then I'm gonna add in me some um a chicken bouillon cube. It depends on how much y'all are making. I'm putting in one whole bouillon cube. Bouillon cube, bouillon cube, whatever. Or you can add in chicken broth. It's up to you. Now I'm adding in my frozen vegetables. Y'all don't mind my son in the background, please. Y'all know how he is. If you watch my other videos, but I'm only adding in a little bit, probably a half a cup of vegetables. I don't want that much. 
I just like the meat and the juice and the crisp. And I'm adding like a tablespoon of butter to go along with that. Scraping all my seasons out the bottom of the pan, the boiler, or pan, whatever you want to say. However you say it. And now I'm going to add in my cream of chicken. I got a little can and I also got a big can. I'm going to add in half of the big can as well. I need to make that again. Yeah, when I tell you this recipe is so bomb, it is like the bomb.com. So y'all need to try this. And we're gonna stir that up real, real good. I'm a I'm folding in everything. So and y'all, another thing, if your chicken break up, that's perfectly fine. That is perfect. Y'all can use chicken, you can use turkey, whatever kind of meat you want to use, I guess. But chicken or turkey, either or. And then I'm adding my heavy cream to this mixture. I'm adding about a half a cup or half of that little container that I'm using. And again, I'm folding it in. Y'all know I had to taste it to make sure everything was right. And y'all know it was. Because your girl don't play when it comes up to her seasoning and her cooking. Okay, guys. So, I'm so sorry I could not finish recording because I was having technical difficulties with my little one. So... I had to give him my phone, and you know how that works. So, I apologize about that. But, when I cut my camera off, all I did was add it in my heavy cream. About a half a cup of heavy cream. Just add it in slow, y'all, because y'all don't want to add too much. Because you can't take it out. So, gradually pour it in there. And um, what else I did? I put the pie crust, my pie crust, the bottom layer of my pie crust in a little baking dish. Put it in the oven for at least 10 minutes. I know it wasn't long. Then I put my um filling, my chicken pie pie filling on top of that. And then I went back and I put the um finishing layer of the pie crust on top. I'm swinging y'all. On top of the uh, chicken pie pie. And I put it in the oven for... 350 degrees right now it's been 45 minutes since it's been in and it's not quite done so i'm gonna leave it in there an hour to let it cook on through and for my pie crust to brown so let me go check on this boy what are you doing what are you doing so i'm gonna show you how i look now since it's in the um since it's in the uh oven that's how it look now I'm let it go for the whole hour and probably some minutes after that. I'll let you guys know. But this is how it looks right now. Or y'all, depending on how fast y'all stove cook, you know. But yeah, like I was saying, y'all, depending on how your stove cook, you know, it can be 30 minutes or however, you know, however long you want to cook or how brown you want your um, pie crisp, you know, or how crispy you want it. But mine's not as brown as I want it to be. So I'm gonna leave it in there for at least 10 more minutes 
after that hour. So I'm not a minute and ten, an hour and ten minutes. But yeah, I'm gonna tell y'all right now, it's so good. Oh my god. I got my mama hands because maybe she could throw down two. And your girl did her thing with the pot with the um chicken pie pie. So yeah, God, I don't want to make this a long video, so stay tuned for the finish look. Oh wait. And and when I before I put my um chicken pie pie in the oven, y'all. I put butter all around my crust. I didn't do the egg wash. I did the butter. So, that's all I want to say. So, just stay tuned, y'all. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, this is the finished look. So guys, this is the end of this video. Stay tuned for more videos. If you haven't watched my latest video, go 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 over and watch that video. Subscribe and like. And um, yeah, guys, and I will see you guys on the next video. Peace. Tell them hey. So I just got my bell, and I got on my baby shark outfit. Say thanks to my aunt Julie, Julia, I think. Look at him, y'all. He, he's sleeping now. He didn't got a good bath. You ready to eat? Mm. Okay. All right, guys. Oh, yeah, guys. I also forgot one little detail. I forgot I bought my potatoes already, and I had let them drain. And at the end, when I was done putting my uh, cream of chicken in, I also folded my potatoes in at the end. Oh. So... I had left that little detail out. But stay tuned for my next videos. Thank you and I love you guys. Peace.